With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, students. Today our question is: A spherical cell is cut into two pieces along two pieces along a cord, as shown in the figure, and P is a point on the plane of the cord, and the gravitational field at P due to upper part is I one, and due to that of lower part is I two. so what is the relation between them so we have a spherical cell and we cut this into two pieces and p is here point so we have to find the relation between the gravitational force acting due to upper and lower part so we have a b c d option is given here so we have to find which option is correct so the solution of this question is we know that gravitational force that is gravitational field at point p gravitational field at point p due to upper part is i1 due to upper part is i1 and due to lower part is i2 so we know that if we cut the spherical cell so i1 is the gravitational field due to the upper part and due to the lower part but we know that gravitational field gravitational field at any point at any point inside the spherical cell is zero so this is the phenomena we know that the gravitational field at any point of inside the spherical cell inside this spherical cell is zero so from this we can say that i2 at the p gravitational field due to the lower part that is i2 at the point p at p due to the lower part must be equal must be equal in magnitude and opposite in direction opposite in direction so this is the relation between them that is i1 is magnitude in i1 mag gravitational field at point p due to upper part it must be equal to the lower part but in the magnitude but change in the direction so this is the relation we get here now we check which option is correct here so our option c is correct thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today